everybody. Today is topic is about hugs and hugging and giving and receiving hugs. And if you have a significant other or a boyfriend and your female friends, acquaintances, strangers come up and hug on him, what is appropriate and what is inappropriate? I have had in in the last couple years some really strange uh, situations that made me feel uncomfortable I'm like this is not cool it's like I really you know I had a kind of a little problem with it so I want to run it by you and, and see once um, I, I'm going to give you my situation uh, uh, we had a couple over for just cocktails and I maybe we had known them just a couple times and when they were getting ready to leave we, were in the, we all got up out of the living room and I, I kind of went first and she's like hugging on my guy she goes oh thank you so much for the evening like a full body hug I'm like that lasted a little longer than it should have and then as we head to the door I go okay well great and I turned around to go back and here she is full body hugging him again and I'm like okay this is like for five seconds which is okay that's not right that on girl code uh-uh mm -mm. no not at all so I kind of get to get upset it's like who does that I didn't even really even know her she just kind of since we lived on the beach you know you kind of meet people that want to be your friend because you live right on the beach so yeah, we had a little tiff that night, and then uh, they came over. I don't know. This must have been a couple months later. And I'm like oh, dreading it. You know, it wasn't my choice to have her back again. And long story short, when she was leaving this time, not only did she do that big full body hug thing, she kissed him on the lips like. You know, and I, I wasn't beside of them, but I was behind them, and I'm and her her date for the night was there, and I was like, I was just like, who does? I've never ever been around somebody like that. It's like, who would kiss your boyfriend on the lips? And it's like, is it like casual to do that out here? I'm like, oh, and then I was, and then that made me just like, I mean, it's not like an old friend. I get it if you, you know, that you know him for years or whatever. I can get that if you really have a deep feeling for them as a friend, you know. But that was just so, I would never do that, never do that to another fellow woman friend of mine, to her husband or her boyfriend or her even her son. The lips is a very intimate part of, your body you know and he my guy blew it oh it was just it was just a kiss and nothing meant, means nothing I'm like oh really so then I guess when he kisses me it meant nothing either it just really that really really hurt me and and that was the first dent in our relationship that just was like wow you know for me this is how hugs should go and hugs can be wonderful. It means I miss you. Oh, I, you know, I, lo I like your friendship. Uh, but they can get out of line, as that did. Totally inappropriate. You know, I mean, us girls have, first of all, got to stick together. I say that all the time. Do something and don't do something that you wouldn't want somebody to do to you or your guy. So for me, a hug that would be appropriate to, for someone to come up and hug my guy or even me. Uh, and as, as us women, we have to know hugging our breasts are included in that hug and some guys are going to get off on that. Some don't think twice about it. And I, I never did either until later in life where we're like, you hug somebody because you want to feel their boobs? Uh, this is just some guys. I'm not saying all of you guys. I mean, I, I don't, uh, it's just, I'm like, didn't even know that because I would hug my dad and stuff. I would never think about my breast touching him or it would be something sexual or get get a guy off. But when you come in for a hug, as us women, hug, you know, hug his shoulders. 
But once you press your breast up against his chest, then you might be in for a little trouble if you don't know his woman that well or the girl. I mean, it's, it's it gets to be a little intimate then because if that's how the guy feels. I mean, I have been hugged by um, uh, guys. I mean, this is only since I've been to the beach that he would just h h squeeze me so tight. I'm like getting getting it, I guess. Maybe he's getting his free feel in. It's like that is like, okay, creepy. You know, it, uh, they, they take hugs to a, a different level, you know, like a sexual level or a get off on it level or just a free feel level. It's like hugs are meant to be just a warm feeling and, oh, I missed you and thank you. And I, oh, you know, I can't wait to see you again. And you mean so much to me in my life. And, and then your, your, your girlfriends there and say, well, yeah, well, we can't wait to see you guys again. But you know, when you're doing it out and your girl's not really near there and you're trying, you know, no, that is so inappropriate and you're going to end up in a fight and maybe if you continue that, you won't be in the relationship much longer because there's only so much women can take in a relationship like that unless you have, you know, a great, strong, solid relationship, which we didn't. You know, maybe that was a lot of it, too. I wasn't getting half that attention at home. Not even a third, okay? Which maybe triggered it. You know, it's like, God, I wish he would hug me like that or just say, oh, you know, I, I really miss you. You know, if, if a woman has that, I don't think I would have thought nothing of it because it's like, oh, you know, he treats me even better than that. And, you know, I that was the start of our demise because... I didn't get it at home and I yeah I was jealous and if anything about girl code is don't don't make each other jealous you know if if I went up to you and I said you know that really bothers me please don't do that again you could say oh I'm sorry I, you know I'm sorry I just do it to everybody but watching this particular woman she didn't do it to everybody like we would have a party she would only do it to my guy and maybe because my guy kind of reciprocated back because we did have words later. She had come by oh, like a year later and I had just said, she goes, you know, we need to, what's wrong? And, and I told her, I said, you know, that's way beyond a friendship. I said, I don't need friends like you, you know, she, well, he reciprocated it back. She threw it back on him, which, you know, okay, I get it. I dropped it. You know, I, I'm not going to start anything because it's, you know, overdone with, but it it really made me think twice about who I want to be with, you know, who makes me feel good, who makes me feel bad. And every time, I hadn't seen her maybe a couple hand times after that, but I could, I could see his eyes would light up when he would see her. It's like, you know, um, you put things together while you're trying to build a relationship that you know if you can handle it the rest of your life if this is how your guy's going to be when there's attractive women around. And I get it if you're friends, but I, like I said, only knew her maybe two or three times. So I was just here trying to tell you how my feelings have been about hugging. Uh, I think it's a great thing. We all need hugs, but some think of it differently. Some go overboard. And some of us are more sensitive than others. But I think, that, like I said, the bottom line is if you're not getting any kind of like that attention at home, it's hurtful. So guys, girls, hug your guy like there's no tomorrow. Do it every day and say, I, I love you dearly. Thanks for caring. Thanks for being there. And, you know, if you don't have a guy, hug yourself. I could do that. I don't have anybody right now. You know, I get hugs from my kids. I, I love it. I think it's great. It's just like, you know, you're worth it. We're all so worth it. And like I said, don't hurt people in life. That's my message. Just girls, don't hurt each other. I, you know, I know there's a lot of cattiness going on. But be kind. Be kind to us all. Because we don't want to hurt. We don't want to have our hearts breaking and, and go to bed sad and wake up sad and have silent tears. Um, I just, you know, I don't want you guys to hurt. 
So let's let's try and work together and just you know enjoy your friends, enjoy your family. But as far as the hugs, keep it in perspective. Then there are those that I haven't seen this too often, but is a back hug where you hug your a guy from the back once again. It is a very intimate hug. You don't see it that often, but it's like, oh, how are you? You know, it's like, it can also be a sexual thing too. If the guy's partner, the woman is looking on and you got your breast and you're squeezing her guy and you're, and then some shake it. Oh, I, you know, oh, you're so great and everything. It's like, don't do that. You know, I could, I mean, if you, if you are like old friends from high school or you grew up together, you were neighbors and you, you know, you're years and years of friends and hey, how you doing, you know? It's like, <laughs> they sometimes hugs get out of control and it just, you know, if it's you're excited and then, hey, how you doing, you know? Um, it's something different, but too many men out there just have a sexual connotation to hugs. And you have to know which guys those are, which guys have the woman that doesn't like it either. You know, just kind of be a little watchful, mindful of that. And, you know, you might not think nothing of it, but uh, others do, especially the mates of those you are hugging. So... Got to kind of be careful on the back hugs. I know there was an instance on the Music Awards, I believe. I forget which ones they were. This this last week, though. And uh, it happened to Beyonce's husband, Jay-Z. Uh, oh, God, I forgot her name, but she did this back hug, and, that, and Beyonce did not like that at all. So that was just like... Right there showed girls that don't do that to your friend's man or any any man that has a woman there. That is like trashy and it, we know what you're trying to do. So, you know, back it off, girlfriends. You know, maybe you should stick to handshakes at that point, you know. But um, I get it. Maybe you're lonely, but don't do it on somebody else's guy. Not, not cool. Love you guys. Happy hugging. Bye.